Hello there and welcome back to the United States of America. Where do we leave off? All oh, that. Oh, we can do some boat stuff, some air stuff. Not really too interested. Okay, I guess we won't do anything. I could... Infrastructure... Doesn't do anything I want. Air production, construction, repair. Air and suppression, naval production. Dockyard output will go up for quite a bit. Or air production. Or... Uh, Naval production would be terrific. Let's take that until we're ready to do anything else. Right, so what are we after? We're after those which are building. Excellent, they will not take terribly long and then we'll have all of those ready. Then we should get some towards the... In fact, if we build this up here, then this, this would get built before and I'll go into the Eastern Navy, so we'll have an extra carrier there. I mean, that will get built before the rest are out. In fact, toward a year. It'll take about a year, but let's, let's get two of them built. Let's get that started straight away. There you go, 2.6 odd a year, so it'll be done in under a year, and then we'll have the factories both onto these here two ships to get them completed. Put you above there to get you out faster. Terrific. Now, I realised what I was missing on the motorised or tank divisions. It is, is motorised. I missed it completely, so we'll do that next. Where is it? Ah, here we go. We're to learn how to build cars, apparently. Now how to build a tank, but not a car. So we'll get on that, we'll start production there, so we get some motorised divisions. Oh, I'll have to wait on you for a while. Lovely. What seems to be lack? Cronium, of course we do. Get a load from our good friends. Over there. Political actions. Nothing really I'm going to be after. Ross. Ah, so steel. I don't need to steal with the other aiding Britain. Emergency arms delivery. That'd be useful at some point. Send them over a load of shit. Arsenal of democracy. Yeah. We'll see about all that stuff later on, but for now, we do have two main armies ready for anything. We have our garrison forces over in the Isles. Can actually buff you up to ten of the extra Filipino forces, huh? I'll take them. There we got Joffrey here. Maurice is going to need that army at some point. Ah, they are training out pretty well in California. Nine of them. Of course, most of them are generic, that's a shame. Huge shame for our good chap there. Oh, well, it looks like uh, we have a bit of a war going on in Europe. Assuming it kicked off the war. Yes. Yes, it did. World War II could be starting very soon. Now, does that include Lithuania? Yes, there are fights on their front. And Latvia and Estonia. Poland and Romania. Ah, of course, Romania has the little border there. So, what do you have? You only have an ally in the uh, Slovakians there, and you're going for around Mijonet. You only have about 100 divisions. Looks like it's going to suck to be Germany. Poland might just be able to hold you off a little bit longer than you would plan. All of their men. Romania helping. Demand a Western guarantee. Well, you're a bit late on that. This will be very interesting to see because Germany is going to ruffle stomp through whoever they fight at first. It'll be interesting to see if the Romanians can help out a fair bit. 40% world tension as well is quite something. Yeah, they've already killed quite a fair few men. Not as many as over here, but. Fucking hours, 10 to 1. 
Uh, it's going down pretty quick. Pretty darn quickly indeed. Nothing I can do to help is there. Uh, Danzig has fallen. No, there's nothing going on over there. What have we got? 35 spare guns. We could try and start a civil war in Germany. If we so wished. It would cost them a load of manpower, at the very least. And equipment. And there is Russia who could exist. Landing craft, well that's great. Let us go back to our land doctrine, however. Great. Uh, Romania has pushed in Slovakia somewhat, but hardly. They are starting to hold. They are. They have lost a fair few, however. The Polish are not doing too well at all. They have lost a lot of land. But the Romanians will have quite a defensive area to stick all of their divisions in. What was it? 40 divisions? 50? A bit of manpower to back it up. Yes, you've got six, three... Three, where they'll all slowly fall. And it's probably only you who is a major power. Which is quite bullshitty. They might be able to get away without... Um, touching... Without touching Romania. Yeah, Romania is not a major power. Somehow Hungary is. Oh yes, they led that little... Roman Pax. Don't you, Horfy? Pact of Rome. It sees Italy, Bowser, hungry, of course. Oh, I can train more. No, just the one more. Well, let's stick him to join the rest over in California. Just the one. Get it done. No, it's not looking terribly good, but they are starting to get bogged down, the old Jerry's. Yes, their losses have gone up a lot, but the Poles are still losing at a terrible rate. Hmm, yeah, the manpower is spent. That's going to leave the Romanians pretty weak down there. Pretty weak indeed. We're giving the Germans all of this. That is definitely not the appropriate music for the time. Not to think that maybe that would happen at a time when it shouldn't be appropriate. Memel hasn't budged. There's no progress there. The only progress is in southern Slovakia. No. Carpathian Rufenia, as we should call it. It would have definitely bogged them down. Maybe that is the Romanian army supporting the lines there. No, it's just Poles dying by the bucket load. All Germans watch. At least these guys are doing their part. They're helping somewhat. They're doing something, at least. Right, we're about halfway through uh, one of our carriers there, which is all well and good. Alright, we're nearly done with all of our other things as well. Plus six to eight, you get that. Yes, that'll be fifteen and fifteen. Terrific. And I already started on the military factories, which should last quite a while, building all of those. It would give us quite a lot of strength when we do it. And I wonder, will they give the east side to Russia? Or the Soviets? Yeah, Germany's not losing terribly much there. Maybe we should start a little bit of a civil war in their nation. How many guns would it take? And the sooner we get started, the better. What is Sendatachi? No, I do not want to do that. We'll stage a coup. 
Democratic coup will do it. Where is defendable? Austria is pretty defendable. We could do it for in Bavaria, because that's where old Adolf tried his own. Tyrol looks like a good place to try it. It's very defendable. How many guns? 23,000 guns. Oh, it's going to take 500 days. Oh, ho, ho. let's get it started as soon as we can then. How much is it going to cost me? Ugh. All of it. That's what it's going to cost me. No, I'll get some work. Can boost this with party popularity. No, we can't afford it, can we? Tyrol, leader of the German Revolution. Who'd have thought? Yeah, at least we've got plenty of guns. Probably already sent them all off. Yes, stage cube against the German Reich is already done. Well, isn't that just great? They're still holding, but where are they getting the men to do it? Oops. Did they spring some more out? No. They should enlist as many as they can. <laughs> They're already up to 700 or 1,000. They've got to be attacking. That's got to be what's keeping the others at bay. They must be doing it. Where's Greece? Well, if, if the Allies can't join with Poland, what's actually going to happen? Absolutely nothing is going to happen. Just have to leave Poland to its own fate. The old Polish. Alright, armoured divisions. I'm not going to train you until I get some vehicles in there with you, my good sirs. Not at all. If Britain isn't going to join against the Minas War, then when are they going to be at war? I don't know. Oh, would you look at that? They're still there. What's it up to now? 900,000? 950,000. Yeah, this isn't really looking good. <laughs> no, no it's not. All I've got to show for it is... Can't pay for and they don't even have all of that. Assault gun focus. Oh, befriend Bulgaria. Yes, you do that. After you just find Yugoslavia, that should create a war. No, no it doesn't. Greater Yugoslavia? What's Greater Yugoslavia? Ah, they want to invade Bulgaria. Well, it looks like there's definitely some tensions on that side of the map. Oh, it's all stopped. They must have ran out. They must have realised it was a terrible idea. Yes, you best hold your horses there, chaps. Get dug in. Can we create more of those fuckers now? No, we cannot. The German Reich has declared war on France. Well, it looks like the Allies are going to be involved indeed. Right, let's have a look at this old Thompson. But this really is not appropriate. Whose idea is it to put this on? What is a weighted shuffle? Yugoslavia claims Bulgaria. Yes, the powder keg sparks once again, and the Serbs are to blame. What have we got? Anything actually going on in my country? Got manpower. The factories on the rise. Hmm. Not quite building enough tanks yet. Or planes, for that matter. Did we build one of those aircraft carriers yet? Yes, we did. 
Oh, that is just splendid. One of these two. Our new friend. We'll have an extra marine there. We'll send him off ready to somewhere. Does that mean the British are at war now? War propaganda against the German Reich. Weekly war support for how long? What do I need to even start a war on someone? What does it say? Justify war goal. I need 100% world tension. Well. Let's go for war propaganda, eh? Ah, I do need points here, but it's barely going down. And I know no I know know what a truck is. I could cancel the naval production. Oh, I could go down knees instead. I gain military factory as well. I Ah Let me get the factories first. Must awaken the giants before we do anything further. I must research something of worth. Some better engineers. And now we can build cars. Well, I'm very happy about that. GMC. I've got a GMC. My vehicle is a GMC. I'm very happy with it. GMC is a lovely vehicle. I mean, the steering gets fucked up in it quite easily, but... That's good enough. Oh, Luxembourg. Luxembourg has joined the war. How valiant of you. I mean, you didn't choose to, but... Still, how valiant. The Dutch are not involved yet. The Belgians, however. Ah, the Dutch are involved. And the old Brits are involved. Well, it looks like Germany's going to be surrounded on all fronts. Poland might not even fall. Not only that, but I might have wasted my time with this whole German thing. They don't have any Italian allies to fill out the ranks. They do, however, have manpower. Horses? Luxembourg has died. Well, that is a terrible shame. The United Kingdom has already lost 28,000 men. Coop in Romania? Oh, that's... Ah, it's just a different king. They are running low on their own manpower. They should be concerned. What do you mean? Guard and National Guard? Why are my National Guards low? They should be high. That's what all my troops are. Motorized divisions. No, I'll die in my tanks and armor together. I mean, my tanks and vehicles together. Make it a lot easier. Oh, propaganda. I should. I should try and get my weekly war support up. Let's get it up a bit. Let's go further. Do need rubber, however. British Malaya. You could trade with me, or I could trade with the United Kingdom. My ancestral homeland, eh? And we're working completely on those now, so we're going to be whacking through these quite fast. Do need, however, to get rid of this. That is crazy. 150 factories is just ridiculous. Direct ground support. I want aces, give me them. How do you get rid of the Great Depression? Arsenal of Democracy. The giant wakes, that might be what it is. I think what I'll do is go prepare intervention, the giant wakes, limited intervention, extra research, lost Manhattan projects, arsenal democracy, we won't go down anything like this yet. Wait, Bermuda, Newfoundland, Leeward Islands, Southern Bahamas, Jamaica, Trinidad, okay. I like that. 
Can I pick all of them? Let's we'll see. Well, we've got research coming through anyway, so we should... Even better... Entrenchment, or do we want even better recon? Let's go for better recon. Switzerland! Well, I never... I did not expect that at all. The old Swiss, of plenty of Germans are going to die there, undoubtedly. And Warsaw still stands. German Reich. Ah. Piling up the old losses there, eh? Same is happening to their enemies. They don't really have the manpower to keep this up forever. Do we have that entire army now? Yes, we do. Terrific. I might keep them locally. Give them a little command at the very least. Mark Clark looks like a man who can lead a naval attack. Oscar Griswold. Yes, give it to Oscar here. Alright, where am I going to go once I get 100% world attention? I believe Cuba needs to disperse from existence. We maybe have a look at starting some shit with them. If we ever get the opportunity to expand. Yes. Yes, we'll leave you around here, my good chaps. Three on each. Oh, there's ten of you. Okay, three on each flank with the uh, the fourth one, the other. Oh, of course, we need to delete the first one because it makes complete and utter sense to do that. Military construction, could you please halt yourself? I would like... You three gentlemen to go from here onto here. I like you three or four gentlemen to go from nya to nya, and I like you three gentlemen to go from here to here. Anyway, thank you for watching this episode. I look forward to seeing you guys next time. Goodbye.